super excited. My spring Fat Fit Fun box is here. Yay! All right, so um, let's get started with choice number one. This is customization one through three for all um, subscribers. And um, there were some really good choices this time. Uh, the first one was a super cute duffel bag. I am very particular when I travel. I like the bags I like. Um, I am really into e-bags. Those are probably my favorite traveling bags. I have the best laptop bag ever. If you want to know more about it, let me know and I will share. Sometimes it goes on lightning on Amazon. I've had it for like three years and it is amazing and it's still in fantastic condition and it has been all over the world. So um, the next choice is what I picked and this is the Paracone MD Essential Rejuvenating Moisturizer. And it says this nutrient packed moisturizer deeply hydrates the skin without leaving a greasy residue. Um, this is the container and um, I'm really excited. I have had several moisturizers from FabFitFun and I feel like they have all been really great. Like I, I felt really good about the moisturizers on my face. So I am really excited to try this one to see how it is. I've heard really great things and this retails for $98. Uh, I will probably not buy this again unless it's like gets rid of all these old lady lines. <laughs> I think the only thing that's going to get rid of those is Botox and that's not going to happen. So, I, well, maybe it will happen eventually. But um, yeah, so 98 bucks. Oh, dang, that duffel bag I just looked down, $150. Maybe I should have picked that one. Um, oh, it smells... It smells pretty good too. It reminds me of something, I don't know what, but anxious to try that one. So that is what I picked. There was also an indoor planter. I'm not a plant person. I kill every plant I've ever, yeah. Nope, not going for that. The retails at 60. There was um, a watch. I'm an Apple Watch girl. I need my fitness tracker, so not my choice. Uh, there was also like a cute tray, super adorable, but, um, I can shop at Hobby Lobby and Kirkland's or something like that. And then there was a UV sanitizer, just things that I wasn't kind of into. Um, and then some face serum, watermelon brightening face serum and an umbrella. So, um, Oh, and packing cubes. I kind of wanted those, but I have a bunch of packing cubes. And if you don't pack with packing cubes, you should because it's super amazing. Um, it keeps everything organized. It's so nice because in the hotel, I don't want to put my clothes in the drawer, but you can put the packing cubes and then pull things out. And it's really awesome. So yeah, that was my choice number one. And like I said, I went with the moisturizer for the face. So looking forward to seeing how that works. All right, so choice number two. Um, this also we got to pick. And um, the first choice is actually what I ended up with. It is not what I wanted because the thing I wanted was sold out. And um, I literally went on like 20 minutes after everything opened. So I was really sad about this. But the thing I got is super cute. So I got this Our Place Lunchbox, which retails for $35. First of all, it's so cute. Do you see this rose gold? Like, it's right in my alley. I really like it. Um, so it like pops off. It's so cute. So this little band comes off and then you open the cute little lunchbox. And I had to play with it a little bit. So it was kind of a pain in the ass, but um, I did. And it has chopsticks and a spoon and a knife and a fork. And it's so cute. It's like pink and gray, which is like right up my alley. 
Um, but anyways, it opens. See, it's like such a pain. Let me see. Let me see. Come on. I guess it seals so you can like, whatever. Um, and so there's like a little compartment inside and then it lifts and there's another one. So this is really awesome. Um, I have been working really hard at meal prepping and having my meals all done for the week. So the um, silverware is the best part. I guess it's not silverware because it's not silver, but it's so cute. I really like it. So I'm anxious to uh, read a little more about this and see what it's all about. But it's super cute. I love, love, love this little rose gold like attachment part. So then your rest of your choices were a billion dollar brown six piece um, pro brush essentials. And when I just read it, I was like, why didn't I get that? Because obviously, if you didn't know, I have naturally brown. La, 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 la. Oh, that might be this talking. <laughs> a little funky Buddha seltzer. Really delicious. Um, but anyways, I have naturally blonde hair. Yes, this is my real color. This is actually darker than my real color. I have super light hair. Um, so I have to paint my eyebrows on because they are super duper blonde. So I read this and I was like, why didn't I order that? Like I could use a $62 brow kit, but um, yeah, no, it was just brushes. So no, thank you. Um, and then there was some um, argon oil for the hair and skin. Not really digging that. I have a bunch of stuff that I tried before with the oils and no, not down with it. So uh, there was a core toning kit, which uh, has an ab ball, which I did not pick, but I just started Beachbody's nine week control freak and you need an ab ball for it. So I bought one on Amazon and if I would have known, I would have got this. Damn it. I just thought of that. Um, yeah. And if you have not done ab workouts with an ab ball, you should probably try it because holy explosive shit. shit. Amazing. Like the toning of my abs this week, it's only been like five days is phenomenal. Like ab balls. Look at it. Try it out. Um, so yeah, I didn't order that, but, uh, whatever. Then there was some planning stuff, planning tools. I'm an Erin Condren girl, not really into any other planners right now. So pass on that. And then, uh, oh, what I really wanted was the Mac lipstick. So I am not really a lipstick person, but, um, I wanted to try it cause I feel like I would like to do some more makeup and whatnot. And like I said, it was sold out. So I love Mac makeup. I use their eyeliner. It's the greatest eyeliner ever. Like literally I can rub my eye and there is none on my finger. Like it's pencil eyeliner. It is the greatest eyeliner ever. If you ever want eyeliner that stays on forever and ever and ever, like literally I wipe and nothing. It's amazing. So I was like looking for it. It was like a light, nice blush pink and then a red. And I'm like, oh, I really want that. Sold out, lame, whatever. So that was option two. And um, I got the lunch kit. So yay. All right. So choice number two. Um, this also we got to pick. And, um, the first choice is actually what I ended up with. It is not what I wanted because the thing I wanted was sold out. And, um, I literally went on like 20 minutes after everything opened. So I was really sad about this, but the thing I got is super cute. So I got this hour place lunchbox, which retails for $35, first of all, it's so cute. Do you see this rose gold? Like, it's right up my alley. I really like it. Um, so it like pops off. It's so cute. So this little band comes off 
and then you open the cute little lunch box and I had to play with it a little bit so it was kind of a pain in the ass but um I did and it has chopsticks and a spoon and a knife and a fork and it's so cute it's like pink and gray which is like right up my alley um but anyways it opens see it's like such a pain let me see let me see come on I guess it seals so you can like whatever um and so there's like a little compartment inside and then it lifts and there's another one so this is really awesome um i have been working really hard at meal prepping and having my meals all done for the week so the um silverware is the best part i guess it's not silverware because it's not silver but it's so cute. I really like it. So I'm anxious to uh, read a little more about this and see what it's all about. But it's super cute. I love, love, love this little rose gold like attachment part. So then your rest of your choices were a billion dollar brown six piece um, pro brush essentials. And when I just read it, I was like, why didn't I get that? Because obviously, if you didn't know, I have naturally la, 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 la. oh that might be this talking <laughs> a little funky Buddha seltzer really delicious um but anyways I have naturally blonde hair yes this is my real color this is actually darker than my real color I have super light hair um so I have to paint my eyebrows on because they are super duper blonde so I read this and I was like, why didn't I order that? Like I could use a $62 brow kit, but, um, yeah, no, it was just brushes. So no, thank you. Um, and then there was some, um, argon oil for the hair and skin. Not really digging that. I have a bunch of stuff that I tried before with the oils and no, not down with it. So, uh, there was a core toning kit, which, uh, has an ab ball which I did not pick, but I just started Beachbody's nine week control freak and you need an app all for it. So I bought one on Amazon and if I would have known, I would have got this, damn it. I just thought of that. Um, yeah. And if you have not done ab workouts with an ab ball, you should probably try it because holy, it was worth the shit. Amazing. Like the, toning of my abs this week it's only been like five days is phenomenal like ab balls look at it try it out um so yeah i didn't order that but uh whatever then there was some planning stuff planning tools i'm an erin conjuring girl not really into any other planners right now so pass on that and then uh oh what i really wanted was the mac lipstick so I am not really a lipstick person, but um, I wanted to try it because I feel like I would like to do some more makeup and whatnot. And like I said, it was sold out. So I love MAC makeup. I use their eyeliner. It's the greatest eyeliner ever. Like literally, I can rub my eye and there is none on my finger. Like. It's pencil eyeliner. It is the greatest eyeliner ever. If you ever want eyeliner that stays on forever and ever and ever, like literally I wipe and nothing. It's amazing. So I was like looking forward. It was like a light, nice blush pink and then a red. And I'm like, oh, I really want that. Sold out, lame, whatever. So that was option two. And um, I got the lunch kit, so yay. The third choice that we got to pick, everyone gets to pick. Uh, there were one, two, three, four, five, five options to choose from. So the first one is what I chose, and that was the Verso Skincare Super Eye Serum. And it just says energizes tired skin around the eyes and targets signs of aging. Oh, I'm 41. I have some serious, uh, we already talked about my forehead lines, but guess what? 
I have some eye lines too. <laughs> so this is what I chose. This is it. Um, so in Stockholm, I like Sweden. I'm Swedish, a little Swedish. So, oh, it has a very like pointy, oh, hey. I don't, I don't even know if I'm supposed to put it on over my, I don't know, but it feels nice. Pat it, pat it. I don't know. It has no scent to it whatsoever. Uh, firming and smoothing eye serum. So let's hope that it gets rid of some of those fine lines. So it retails at $65 for this little teeny tiny tube. And, uh, yeah, so we'll see how it works. Um, let's see. There was a reversible bucket hat for $85. I did not know that bucket hats were back in style. I may have one time in my younger years, um, <laughs> been on a bar in Vegas in a coach bucket hat. When I first started teaching, I thought it was really great to spend my paycheck on like stupid shit. And a coach bucket hat was one of those things I sold it at a garage sale a couple years ago. Uh, yeah, so apparently bucket hats are back in style. Who knew? Um, there's also a really, actually a really, really pretty ring. And it almost looks like it's Peridot, my um, birthstone. It was really pretty, but... I don't do costume jewelry. It's not my thing. I just kind of stick to the same things that I wear all the time. So I did not choose that. Uh, and then there were some seagrass coasters. Again, I'm not wasting a pick on some coasters. I have plenty of coasters from Kirkland's in my house that are just fine. And then there was, uh, oh, I must have missed the slippers on the two on the second pick sorry i get i have really bad add also and yeah, that's not the alcohol it's just i have add um there were slippers that i kind of wanted yeah i love slippers lately i have a lot of tile in my house and in florida you have the air on all the time so you need that but anyways sorry back to that there was a hair mask for 55 bucks and um i have a hair mask in my last box that i really like and it's really nice, like, for some self-care to be in the shower and, like, you know, have a little hair mask. So, I didn't pick that one this time. Uh, yeah, so I am excited to try that eye serum and see what happens and go from there. So, stay tuned for my next round. Customization number four. Um... Annual members get to pick four and five, so I get mine annually, so I got to pick on this one. Um, there was a cute little makeup organizer, but I already have one in my vanity area, so I did not pick that. Um, there were some facial cleansing gel, which Ahava, um, I really like their products. Um, a couple of hotels that we stayed in in Tokyo and Hong Kong uh, have a Hava products, Paris too, I think. Um, so they were really awesome and I like their stuff, but I have a bunch of it already. So I wanted to try something new. There was a Sea Mud Deep Cleansing Bar. I don't know how I felt about like bars in general. I the only bar I use is like a soap in the shower. Um, I really love Irish Spring soap when I take a shower. It's just like the one thing I feel like, you know, people use like Bath and Body Works, like loofah and body wash, whatever. No, I just want like some really good like bar soap. I know, rando. Um, so then there was like a scarf bundle, which I thought was super cute, but a big forehead and um short hair and like when I put my hair back it's not cute so no scarves I mean when I work out I do but other than that no they're really cute though so if you haven't picked your stuff yet like I would suggest them because they're awesome um and then the grown alchemist body cream 
with mandarin and rosemary is what I chose. Uh, retail $26. So this is the actual bottle. It's a really pretty blue color. It's almost Tiffany blue. Ooh. Um, so I got their facial moisturizer, I think in my last two boxes ago, actually. And I loved it. Like I felt like it was such a nice moisturizer. So I thought, why not get their body cream? Um, it just talks about nourishing and hydrating with, um, bioactive ingredients and, um, oh, it smells really good to me. I do not smell any mandarin. Like mandarin is an orangey scent and I don't smell that. I love, um, speaking of lotions and things that I love, Aesop has like a orange peel lotion. When I went to the Park Hyatt in Tokyo, um, the lotion there is, they used the mandarin lotion there and, oh, I like am obsessed with it and every time I go to a store I have to get more hand cream but um this definitely has no mandarin scent to me I don't think I oh I do smell it a little, <laughs> a little bit as I like totally inhale it um I, I smelled a little bit of the mandarin actually now um it's really nice, so I'm excited because, as we all know, we're, like, washing our hands, like, four million times a day. And, um, yeah, my hands are super dry, so I, I plan. It's actually really nice. It's, uh, after you rub it in, it's very, like, smooth. It almost feels like baby powder on your hands, so that's super exciting. Uh, I'm excited to try this out and use it, put it in my purse. And the Tiffany Blue Bottle is tube I guess is super super cute um they had some enzyme peels and um I think that was it for that customization so uh natural fruit enzymes for the right room moisturize the skin oh that would have kind of been a nice choice I don't know why I didn't pick that one but I think it's just because I really like the other product so much so that was customization four. And then we will look at customization five. Watching this video. So the first choice was uh, face and body dry oil. I don't know, didn't pick that one. There was some dip dye, uh, dip dye market tote. Yeah, I mean, I know. I go to Aldi sometimes. I'm supposed to bring a bag or whatnot, but I just never remember. So I either end up carrying like 8,000 things out. Like, here I come. Sorry, I didn't bring a bag. I shove it in my purse. I don't know. So maybe I should have bought that, but I didn't. Um, And then something tropical trio. Oh, it's like dental floss. I'll just keep using the Colgate or Crest or whatever dental floss. I really like the little dental picks. Um, so that was weird um, that dental floss even came in the box, but whatever. Um, so then what I picked was the Summer and Rose Tweezers. I remember I talked about my uh, <laughs> colored in brows. So, um... Everyone's always like, why do you even get your eyebrows waxed? You don't have any eyebrows. Oh, I do. If I could pull this phone closer to me and show you, it's really bad. And they're so bad right now. I got my nails done last weekend. Uh, we ran out of time because, you know, we were trying to have a good day off and go gambling and whatnot. And so I uh, was like, oh, I'll just get my eyebrows done another time. I shouldn't have waited. But anyways, I ordered tweezers and these are super cute. I, you know, I just really like floral things. So it has like a little tweeze, a little pouch. I like them. So I am very excited about that. I can like <whistles> fix these crazy brows that are happening in my life. Um, I do need to go get them waxed though. So that's what I chose, 20 bucks. Uh, the other thing was um, some aloe infused gel line socks and a pumice stone. I might have needed that too. <laughs> uh, I get pedicures, but Lord Jesus, if I could 
get one every day, I totally would. So yeah, that's a $40 value and maybe that would have been a lovely option as well, but I didn't pick it. So that was customization five. And then the last, uh, I think there's six, seven, and eight are ones that FabFitFun picks for you. Last time I was not super pleased with them. So I am anxious to see what they chose for me this time. Stay tuned. Nation six, these are the FabFitFun picks. Um, oh, I wish I would have got this. I did not get this. And um, the first thing they could have picked was a two pack of these super cute flower um, hair clips, uh, 30 bucks and see this. I like to like pull it back out of the way. So I thought like, ooh, that would be super cute. I didn't get that choice. It's okay, no problem. All right, so then there was like a hand scrub, elderflower and raspberry, which was 15 bucks. And then there was this um, Earth Harbor Marina Biome Brightening uh, Ampoule. I don't know. Is that how I say it? I have no idea. Uh, Ampoule. It, uh, phonetically, that's how you say it. I don't really know if that's how you say it. So this is what it is here. Okay. And um, it says this oil features spirulina and blue tansy to vigorously brighten and balance the skin. It's gonna vigorously brighten and balance my skin. Ooh, it's a fun little bottle. It's like my, uh, oh, my uh, liquid melatonin. That is my favorite sleep aid in the whole entire world. Let's. Um, sorry, it's, it smells like something, but I, it's like minty, but it, it smells like something that I, it reminds me of childhood. I have no idea, but apparently I think you like clean your face and then beep, 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 drop it all over and, and rub it in. So this will be very interesting. It's plant-based and there's no GMOs and it's vegan and it's cruelty-free and it's sustainable and there's no soy and it's owned by women. Yay. I don't know. Whatever. We'll try it and see. But uh, let's see what it says. A radiant complexion. Will my complexion be radiant? I don't know. I'll try anything once. It's fine. Perfect. Lovely. Great. All right. So then let's move on to choice seven, which is again, FabFitFun's pick. So, oh, I got this one. The first choice, right? It says sun's out, pops out. And it is a four piece gold foil lip mask. <laughs> It just makes me laugh. So, uh, kiss dry lips goodbye. Botanical extracts deeply hydrate and condition the lips for a smoother pout in minutes. Oh, great. I need a smooth pout because I'm making out with so many people over here. Um, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> it just made me laugh. And I'm anxious to see, like... How is this go? Like, what's going to happen when I put this on my lips? I have no idea, but like I said, totally going to try it. It says, position the mask on the lips. Leave for 10 to 15 minutes. Remove the mask and gently massage any excess product into the skin. Great. And no need to rinse. Maybe I'll have the smoothest lips ever and I can get a date. Please. All right, so my final um, pick. Oh, let me tell you what else. Oh, there was like a sipper cup that looked like a cactus. Oh, 
I'm going to show you this. I am so glad they didn't send this to me. I probably would have just sent it back. Nobody wants a zipper cup that looks like a cactus. That's terrible. Okay, sorry. All right, so then um, the last, oh, and there was another choice. There was a body wash. Um, wash away the day without drying out the skin. So that would have been nice too. I'd have been fine with that. So then the, the eighth choice, there were only two things, and one of them was um, nail polish, which I am glad I did not get because uh, Hannah does my nails. Hannah always does my nails, a little dip powder, so I would have been disappointed in that. So I'm glad I did not get that. So I got the reusable beauty rounds, and when I opened the box, I was like, I have no idea what these are. I thought they were maybe like furniture movers or something. And then the back of it said uh, quantity and then in a couple other languages. And then below it, it said three tampons. Yep, for sure. It said three tampons. And I thought, that's so. I won't say that bad word, but I was like, what the hell? Tampons? What am I going to do with this? No, they are actually reusable makeup removers. So that's actually kind of nice. I'm excited to try these out. And um, I've been trying to be really, really good about removing my makeup every night. And Oh, they're so soft. Um... But I get like lazy and I don't know why I should just come home and I come home and I, you know, shower or whatever and clean off the filth from work and um, put my pajamas on. So like I should just scrub my face along with it, but I don't, I'm lazy and I like to keep my eyebrows on for a little bit longer. So um, maybe these will help. I, I have wipes and whatnot, but these are really kind of soft and nice, so I'm anxious to see uh, how they work. we scrub scrubbing my face later and let you know. Okay, that's it. So that was my spring FabFitFun box. Um, I am super excited about this time around. Last time there were a couple things that I felt were a little disappointing. Like I got scrunchies for, I have no hair. I don't need a scrunchie. And then um, I got some nail serum and I do dip powder. So I felt like it was kind of worthless, but gave it to, to my friend Elise. So that was fine. Um, so yeah, I'm really excited about this time around. Uh, I hope you enjoyed watching my random commentary and all of my fun stuff in the box. I'm anxious to try it all out. If you have any questions, let me know. If you want a code for your own FabFitFun subscription, let me know also. And uh, stay tuned for my next FabFitFun box coming in summer of 2021. Hopefully with some traveling because I'm dying, not going on vacation. But um, yeah, so if you haven't subscribed to FabFitFun, you totally should. It's like Christmas four times a year. It's really fun to get the boxes and they always have really good products. So uh, check it out and I'll see you all soon. Bye.